Alrighty guys, welcome back for more WWE Raw. We got a big, big match here. We got CM Punk versus Daniel Bryan. The two biggest stars, man, at the time of the new generation. These guys were arguably the two newest guys who were the biggest back here. Um, I think, I'm not sure, man. I mean, these two guys have fought at uh, independent shows back in the days when they weren't big. You don't know what you're talking about, a lot of Michael. people predicted they would get into the WWE at Just some point like and would become one of the biggest stars. When you think of Daniel Bryan, you think of CM Punk. When you think of CM Punk, you think of Daniel Bryan. These two guys grew up in the independent scene, man. Although they had different routes to get here, CM Punk came in around 2006. I think he uh, made his debut at ECW's One Night Stand in 2006. Or it was 2006 for sure, against Just Incredible. I remember that like it was yesterday. And uh, Daniel Bryan came in during the NXT competition. Season 2, was it season 2 or 1? I'm not sure which season it was. He had The Miz as his uh, mentor. And look how, look where both of them are now. Daniel Bryan's at the top and The Miz is still a mid-carder. Although he was a main event for maybe a few months. But they would never bring him to that point ever again. It's crazy how <laughs> The Miz was the mentor of Daniel Bryan. And look at where they both are in their um, careers right now. Daniel Bryan, the biggest star, arguably, Austin. right now. And The Miz, just a oh, freaking rock the wannabe. WWE can turn on a dime. And that's a stiff kick. Boy, he was able to reverse and get out of that. CM Punk. It's kind of weird, though, because... um. Uh, CM Punk is married to AJ Lee and she's employed by the WWE so I'm not sure if she's getting heat in the back or what because she's associated with CM Punk like, it must be quite awkward for AJ Lee who knows maybe not but I think it, I can imagine it being quite awkward having CM Punk just leave like that and being married to CM Punk and the WWE not actually being fond of that I think they're trying to erase him from the records as well like literally trying to erase his history and what he's done for the WWE because of what he uh, decided to do and just walk away just decided not to turn up for the night I don't think he ever be back in the WWE I think he's done man I don't think the WWE are really fond of him coming back either look in my eyes what do you see oh Come on. Monday Night Raw heads to ah, the world. Crap. Do yourself a favor and go be a part of the longest running weekly episodic television show in history. Oh no. Oh. Daniel Bryan had that well Insecurity. Daniel Bryan. And he's forced back in the ring. The reversal from Punk. Punk. Here we go. Neckbreaker. Watch it. He looks fired up here. Technical bat right here. He's going to take a chance here. Oh, my God. Oh, He's no. The leg drop missed. The tension. The drama. This is electric. Oh, what a No. Kick. Reversal. God damn it. Just cutting down his opponent. You can feel the impact of those kicks from the cheap seats. Oh, what a knee. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. Oh, no. Did you hear that impact? Go for that anaconda vice. Here we go. Oh no, I tried to land a couple of ice. He reversed it. Stole it. Stole my finisher. God damn, this is so competitive right now. Uh oh. Yes, Lark. No. No. My God, hit the yes, Lark. Oh, crap. 
Oh, what a kick. Blasted. CM Punk got absolutely blasted there. Punk counter. Yeah. Brian's in. Oh, Punk back in control. Scoops them into a leg drop. The force behind that leg drop. Cole, what you got in mind? He's got. Oh, why you got to turn that way? Got him. That could be it. And again, Punk going Punk's going for it. Looking my eyes. And the kind of ice. My submission. Oh, he's about to tap. He's just resiliency. Yes, Lock versus the Anaconda Vice. He hasn't really used this move often anymore. He used to use it back in the days a lot as his finisher. Now he's got the good GTS. And he breaks the hole. God damn. I guess he wants to try something else. I don't know what more you'd want to do to another man. You want that? You want it? I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so oh, no. physical. Welcome to our arm for the S lock again. Hulk countered it. Oh God. Oh, reversal. Oh. He fails to connect. Oh yes, the octopus. Look at this, it's locked in. What diabolical things are going through that mind right now? When you get in control like this, you want to throw everything. I cancel that because I don't want to end it like that. What we're seeing here. Again with a scoop slam. And there's some more emotion on display. If you're just joining us, welcome to Monday Night Raw. I'm Michael Cole, alongside the Hall of Famer Jerry, the King Lawler. What's he going to try to pin me from a trip? Good there we go. Fire in his eyes. He was able to reverse that. Go ahead. Got it. Oh yeah. Oh no, the comeback didn't work. What thunderous impact. Go for a dragon sleeper. Holy crap. Listen to this place come alive and build CM support Punk. for him. CM Punk. You're tuned into Monday Night Raw live and in high definition. The physicality. Here we go again. He can barely stand, but he still presses on. Nice comeback, huh? Oh no. No one home for that one. Daniel Bryan's going for it. Oh, one uppercut. This is a tough match. It's been pretty long as well. This could do. He's got to do more damage before he can get a three. Cheats! Oh. Oh crap. Oh crap. No! No! Oh! Kick to the skull. That should do it. Well, that might do it. Here's a cover. Two. That's it. Nope, not yet. Three. Only two. Oh, GTS, baby. Time. Crack. And there's the go to sleep. Knee to the temple. If you're just tuning in, Michael Cole. A walk. We got a cover. Two. two. He got it. Huck did it. Huck got a huge win. That was a big win against Daniel Bryan. Although the oh, fight could have went either way. The WWE Universe will be buzzing about this one for a while. Who has the better theme song? The better entrance? Daniel Bryan or CM Punk? It's a little obvious who has the better one. Though. It's a little obvious. CM Punk, obviously. This song is just the best. What a sight that is. What's he saying? Go to sleep, baby. Oh, 
Alrighty guys, hopefully you guys have enjoyed that match. That should have been main event material right there. It's a shame it's the fourth match. That should have been main event or co-main event. I'll see you guys next time for more Raw matches. Peace, guys.